Hundreds of people signed their name or left a message on the white steel beam, outfitted with flags and a little pine tree at the construction site. It's taken a year to get to this point, a web of steel and concrete that will become a seven-story building on top of the emergency department at the UVM Medical Center. When it opens in 2019, the hospital will be able to offer private rooms to almost every patient for the first time. With space for families to be with their loved one at a really vulnerable time. And so this is a huge step forward for all of us. It will be called the Miller Building, named for Vermont philanthropists Holly and Bobby Miller. They donated $13.5 million, believing patients will benefit. You know, we're blessed that we can do it. Glad that we can do it. On this day, work came to a halt for a topping off ceremony apparently rooted in Scandinavian tradition. And I'd like to pause a moment for all you guys and a couple gals. And the hospital gals. CEO thanked hundreds of construction workers for getting to this point. Thank you. Most of the labor is local from Vermont or upstate New York. And though it will be a while longer before the $187 million project is finished, this was a milestone as a giant crane lifted the final and tallest steel beam into place. This really is a centerpiece of a rejuvenation of this whole campus that fits totally with how in the future we're going to be delivering health care for this region. The new Miller Building is going to have 128 private patient rooms. It's on track to open in the summer of 2019.